Hey friends, today I'm starting this journal and I'm using Recollections um, crayons here. Water soluble crayons, water pens here, and um, magazine cutouts and different scraps that I have and sprays um, that I have lying around leftover art. Um, this is just a regular mixed media scrapbook. I don't know if I opened it up to show you the cover, but it's a mixed media art book that I, I got from Michaels. So what I'm going to do is lay down some color, use my water soluble pens to move it around and start with that as a base. Here I find some scrap papers and cutouts from magazine and I'm decided to uh, make use this girl and do some kind of hair around her and these pieces I have here are just like parchment paper type of things that were actually wax paper for baking and I used them either probably like underneath something or you know like to protect my table or space and that's so that there's scrapped pick up paint type of papers. So then I put my girl down. I use um, decolletage from um, Deck Arts to adhere all this stuff down. And I just go crazy with it. I'm not too worried about how much glue I'm using. I'm using a pretty good uh, book here. So the mixed media ones don't buckle and stuff. So I really like using them. I have to dry this up now to use my marker, paint pens and stuff like that. And I decided to do a flower here and I do one on the other side as well. And um, use my Posca pens to color that in. And I also use pens, um, paint pens from Deco Art as well for the white. I believe I'm using a white paint pen from Deco Art as the base and then I use my colorful Posca pens to color in my flowers. The nice thing about Posca pens is you can add a little water and move them around. So that's really kind of neat if you get a wet brush and it works really nice to add water and paint with them. I also decide to um, add a little bit more um, 
the watercolor pencils around the hair too and get some of that going. It's looking a little dull. There we go. I grab that and just kind of make her hair orange. It just popped into my head to do an orange and move that around with some water on a brush or a water brush, I think. Yeah, I just use water. <laughs> At this point, I'm kind of trying to get creative and moving my water, my Posca pens and the water with brush and water and uh, do a little face, change it up a bit. Went with a little bit of a clown look. Um, just to be silly, it was just winging it. I had never thought about it. I just went with it and just started playing around. I am on this video I was um, doing a recording with Nikki Parr doing a live stream and um, she was working on her journal I was working on mine so if one of us is not done or whatever we continue just working until we're both done so it sometimes it can get really crazy if the other person's not done and we're just waiting for them to get done and so sometimes you just go with you go with it And here I have my, um, I'm going to be adding some um, script or writing to it and I have uh, like a gift box and the lid has all the writing in it and I put the, the box part on top of the lid so I leave it open and so I keep all the writing pieces, printouts and all the words, whatever, sentiments in the bottom which is the lid and then the box with my pictures and other scraps that I like, things I keep in the box so I keep it all together and I always leave the lid on the bottom and that's how I keep it and here I'm just putting a good layer on of decoupage so that nothing smears and I can just do whatever and add whatever I want to it and move it with water and then the stuff on the bottom that was already protected with the decoupage won't move So I hope you guys enjoyed this little um, journal 
it was fun and easy to just grab what you have and go in and just play. And um, yeah, if you guys want to check out Nikki Parr and myself, we usually live stream on Wednesdays. Um, our YouTube channel is International Crafters. We are taking some holiday right now, but uh, that's uh, for normally we do stream Wednesdays midday. So I hope to see you guys there. Thanks for watching. Bye bye, everyone.